Welcome to The Delilah Show. Look, I am so excited to have you with us. Now we're on YouTube weekly at 8 p.m. on Thursdays. How wonderful, and I just love seeing you. So please, please subscribe to our channel and get your friends to. Anyway, let's get on with the show. Right, viewers, look, I'm with Clara, and every time I see Clara, I, I get emotional. Did you know that? I can see that. I know. Emotional with happiness. Oh, yes, because, because Clara and I are best friends, aren't we, Clara? Yeah, we've just Apparently. been, you know, look, we've, look the, the whole thing is, is that Clara just loves um, all the um, excitement of um, all the things I've been taking to lately, and, um, and it's been really good, hasn't it? Yes. Yes, yep. I know. It's been great. And, and Clara and I have been clubbing. Remember that night? Oh, yeah, 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 it was really yeah. good. I mean, I, I really had an exciting time, you know, and, <laughs> um, but then all of a sudden he left me on the dance floor and, and I, then I was just surrounded by, these, surrounded by all these gorgeous guys and I, I don't know, and I don't know what they were, they, but they had funny smirks on their face. That's because they were security guards. <laughs> <laughs> well, true, true. I know, and they did ask me to leave, but, you know, but, you know, it was the dress I was wearing. Ah, yeah. yes. I think that was, oh. the pro that was the problem. Look, anyway, tell me about what's been going on. I know you, I saw you down at Sala. I mean, you know, it was exciting, wasn't it? And, yes. and uh, I, I looked around and there's uh, Clara and, and you put some your beautiful paintings in. And, okay, I want to look at some of these. Okay, yeah, so what's, sure. what's this one here? Okay, so, um, so as you all know, uh, I do macro photography and... Um, and it's basically concentrated on the subject of textures and the hidden worlds you can find in textures. Mm. And if you, um, uh, so they're all obviously using the mirror function on my camera. And uh, my theory is if you mirror chaos, it becomes a pattern. So, okay, great. Yeah. And what is this actually? Um, so this is uh, burnt milk on a saucepan. And really? I, just... I would never... I would, <laughs> it looks like a flower. Well, that's great that you say that because everyone sees different things in each of them. Some people yeah. see butterflies and... Yeah, yeah, I know. Well, that's what I thought it was, but, you know... That's anyway. because, you know, you're a beautiful flower. So well, can... I know. I, <laughs> I realise that. I mean, I've been told that so many times and I'm so happy that you've mentioned it again. Oh. I mean, you know, like Cindy, a good friend of mine, she, and, and Nikki too now, she's just tells me I'm a beautiful flower all the time um, anyway so just right. let me show me this other one um, sure um, okay so that, that's an interesting one yes so it's using abalone shell uh, fossil and ice okay um, and it's I called it the relic uh, reliquary <laughs> um, or a repository for <laughs> repository for holy yeah. relics. Um, to really? me, it kind of looked like a sort of a place where you feel sort of spiritual. Yeah, so, yeah. Well, yeah. I look into it, and it looks like a, almost a. To me, it's got a man in there. If you look at it closely, oh. there's a man, and like a Henry. Not Henry. No. <laughs> no, no, not, no. It's not Henry, but. <laughs> There's a man in the middle of it. So that's okay. interesting if you look at it closer. But anyway, all right, well, listen, I want you to come back and tell me more because I love hearing about your art. And, oh, thank and you. We are best friends after all with that clubbing we did. Mm. Yes. Anyway. Mm. 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 G'day, girls. It's Lady Fred. Well, today we're going to be talking about finding something around the yard that you can put up and make as a pot plant. I found this wonderful silver dome chrome skeleton mask. Now, what, I, what I'm going to do with this, which is very inventive, is that you can turn it upside down and put your pot plant flowers in the hole at the bottom. Now, isn't that a wonderful? You put it up like that and then you can rock it. Rock it a little bit if you want to, if you get a bit excited about, you know, like... Uh, meditation outside or something when you're looking at your flower coming up that's what I reckon that it's a wonderful idea it's just such a smart idea the lucky friends come up with to put around the house and you know like have a bit of a meditation outside 
find a little skeleton like, like your friend, put it upside down, plant your dirt in the bottom, and then put a couple of flowers in. What a wonderful idea. That's like your friend's tip for this week. Boy! <laughs> Right viewers, I'm with Courtney and it's great to see you again and look, tell me about your paintings. Well, good news. Two have been sold already. So. Two? Yes. Oh my God. Well, I thought that when I first saw your paintings, I must admit I was very intrigued. You know, like I said, uh, we had David Bowie yes. and, and you sold the one above. Yes, Jimi Hendrix. Jimmy. Yes. I mean, Jimmy is fantastic. Oh. Oh, he was just a, a before his time. Yes, definitely. So, tell us more. Okay, so I am. Um, Enjoying Sala? I am, it's beautiful, it's such a good atmosphere, I absolutely love it at the moment. Yes. Um, had quite a few, I didn't expect such a turnout, it's been great. So, yes. Yeah, so I've had quite a few friends come along. Yeah. And yeah. Um, yeah, it's been wonderful. I mean, you know, the art that you're doing at such a young age is just amazing. Oh, cause, thank you. Because uh, <laughs> you're only young, aren't you? Yes, I'm only, I'm 21. 21! Yes, so oh, <laughs> terrible, yeah. Yes, so, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I know. That is young to yes, start off, yes. but you've been painting all your life. So. I have, yes, yes. Yeah. So um, I've been painting since I was little. I think I've yes. always had a paintbrush in my hand or a pencil yeah, or something yeah. artistic. So. Well, now you're in the exhibition and it looks just amazing and people are loving your art. So yes. look, you are going to go places. Oh, I hope so. I what, hope so. What I reckon you should do is one day aim for the big one. Oh, I hope so. Yeah, yes. so, you know, like, um, uh, I think, what it's, it's called, isn't it? Oh, terrible? Uh, you know, the oh, one that... Oh, there's heaps of competitions. Yeah, around, lots so. of competitions. Yeah. Yeah, yes, yeah, yes. Yeah. So, but the big, you know, the big, because um, you love doing portraits. I so, do, yeah. yes. Uh, Archibald portrait, isn't it? That's yeah. the Archibald. I'm trying yes. to think of it. I Archibald. only saw it recently yeah. and I'm yeah, crazy. Yeah. So. But anyway, all right, well, take care. Thank you very much. And uh, Courtney, enjoy tonight. Thank you. Have fun with your friends Thank and you. have a great sala. Thank you very much. Take care. Thank you. <laughs> right, wake up. Oh, Henry, look. Oh. I know every time you bring me down to go to Olga, it's just wonderful and I'm really enjoying it. We're actually in Boomers at the beach. Right in front of the beach. Yeah, I know, I Near know, it's journey. wonderful. And uh, tell me why you brought me down here. Oh, just a day. It's, well, I had a day off, you see, so I thought i will come down here and have some lunch and oh. went to the art dinner and everything, didn't we? Oh, you're so <laughs> romantic, Henry. I know, I know. You're just lovely. You're just you're so my wonderful. little honey bun. I know, I know, I know, I know this. And uh, um, are you going to shout me at lunch today? Oh, of course, my love, of course. Yes, thank you. And I haven't been to Boomers no. um, before and it's and it's right on the beach front. Hmm. Very interesting. Yeah. Like, anyway, why have they got bikes on the ceiling? Uh, well I don't know, maybe they like riding on the on the roof or something like that. But look, I really, really love it here. It's mm. just wonderful, relaxing. So yeah, you should get yourself down to Boomers to the beach. But anyway, thank you Henry brings me here. You're so wonderful. Anytime, my <laughs> precious. Mm. Oh, marvellous Mike here. Oh, I'm, as you can see, I'm dressed to uh, marvellous perfection. I just had myself a marvellous coffee. It must be the, the most marvellous coffee in Adelaide. It's a place called Coffees Are Us. And I actually had four coffees in a row. They, they are that good, you know. Um, so I might, I might even go back there again. It's actually only a dollar a, co a coffee. Can you believe that? A dollar. Oh. And I, you know, I've got so much money. I'll, I'll probably go back a couple of times. But ah, uh, but you know, it's so marvelous the coffee. It's so all the froth and the sugar. Oh. And um, you know, you know, I just like doing things marvelous. You know, marvelous things. So coffees are us. It, there's a few. It's a franchise. So there's a few places around that you. Really must try it. Oh, but I'm so marvellous, aren't I? But I know marvellous places to eat, marvellous places to drink. But if you see it, coffees are us. You know what? I might have a go and have another cappuccino. Get some more froth on my uh, nose and my mouth. And then, yeah. See ya. Marvellous Mike. Bye. Right, I'm back with Jacko. It's good to see you again. Good and uh, look, um, it's been a few weeks. And how excited are you about Sala? Amazingly good. Yeah. It's amazingly good. It's it's the biggest scene I've been in for years. Yes. And the, the Sala exhibition book looks like a telephone book of really great Australian artists. Yes. I mean, 
yes. we're attracting such talent around this yes. place. Yeah, I know. And um, well, we're back at the Glenorg Art Gallery, and you've travelled down. Did you stay? Did you go back home and then come back? Or well, did you yeah, stay? yeah, yeah. That, that must have been a bit of a travel. Well, cause, I cause live so in Renmark. On Renmark. The, on that, the river. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. So it takes what three hours? About three or four, depending on traffic. Oh, the traffic. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So, but, but look, it's a kick being in Adelaide. Yeah, mm-hmm. yeah. The buzz and and everything yeah. and having fun with the you know busy traffic yeah. and all that sort of stuff. Yeah. But I'm a country boy, you know. Yeah. We go, we go about two, two and a half miles an hour. <laughs> in Renmark, we say it's a bit slow there. We say yeah. <laughs> It takes us an hour and a half to watch 60 Minutes. <laughs> That's it. No, it's great to uh, uh, have you uh, on our show again. And also, uh, and uh, good luck with the, with the art for this sala. Thank I mean, you, you know, much. It's, uh, Anyway, lovely seeing you again, Jacko. You too. Thank you. Take care. Thanks very much. Bye-bye. Right. I'm with Cindy. And I'm with Gigi, my best friend from my school years. Wasn't it wonderful back then? Ah, oh, yes. We, we used to sneak out. I know we used to sneak catch, out. And look for boys. Yes, I know. <laughs> and I, I found a few and boys, drink. and so did you. Yeah, we yeah, a drink. Mm. Okay. <laughs> All right, we're and naughty girls. Naughty girls. girls. <laughs> we were naughty girls. We're very and when naughty. When you're young, you've got to have a fun, huh? Yeah. And, well, Once you're married, <laughs> yeah, yeah, I know. Now, that's what I want to talk about, you know, marriage. You know, what? what's the main thing that we should do when you get married? You know, like, should the husband take you out on Valentine's Day? See, si. but Gigi. <laughs> no, but some time <laughs> Valentine's Day is not about spending the money. It's stay home and you have a nice dinner. He, he mm. buy you flowers and chocolates and champagne. Yes, and you have a, a nice vino, yes. and you sit a nice. That's you know a bit yeah. of attention. Yeah, that's you right. Know, put the kids to bed early. Yes, mm-hmm. yes. Right, and what what do you think? That should that happen? Do you reckon that's a good thing for I think for marriages? Going for a picnic. Picnic? Yeah, and beautiful day yes. in the park. Lovely. Nice blanket, nice bottle of yeah. vino. Yeah, vino. But <laughs> yeah. very hard to Some do when you've got six or seven cheese. children. Oh, you see. <laughs> so, you know, and not everybody have money to go to a hotel. Yeah. So, every now and then, so well, even nice, just get babysitter. Yeah. Got some restaurant, yeah. You know, well, yeah. I, cheap hotel. One, you know, I I know of somebody that he took his wife out um, for Valentine's Day, which is romantic. It was on a gondola, and it was really quite romantic. But because it was a bit dear, he shared it with another couple, and then he went out to a really, really wonderful restaurant. A lot of nice restaurants. And it was yes, a beautiful restaurant. And it was um, uh, Macca's. Uh, so I just wonder what, what you thought about that. Was that? You must have been was, in Siena because no, Mito, that, Siena. Do you, do, you was, do you reckon he's like a bit of a cheap steak? Or? I think he's in big trouble if he's taking another couple on a gondola ride. <laughs> <laughs> it must have been Siena. It must have been Siena because there's no McDonald's in Venice. Forget the Macca's. You, <laughs> you, you, get, you get really confused bad. because in Siena, in Siena, in the Tuscany. They go to McDonald's there. Yeah, well, mm-hmm. what do you, yeah, well, I, I don't know. Uh, I, you're I just, not talking, I just thought, you're not know, talking that, about him, is Lee. That, is that, like, do you reckon that might be a little bit, you know, as far as the girl's point of view, a bit of a cheap Cheapskate, steak? absolutely. Do, do you think, what, <laughs> what was your opinion on that one? Depends how much money, and maybe poor guy not have enough money. Yeah, well, I don't like, mind McDonald's. <laughs> <laughs> well, anyway, <laughs> so, so really, if you're going to take your girl out on a Valentine's Day, Probably don't go with another couple. Make sure it's just with, <laughs> with, with your a good start. <laughs> wonderful partner. And Mac as well. Yeah, maybe give uh, <laughs> may, maybe give that a miss. But anyway, that's the tip for this week on Tell It Like It Is. Uh, we do, we do. We do. I like roses. I like tulips. <laughs> Violets. <laughs>
Well, viewers, I'm back with Gigi. Look, I always really love Gigi coming on the set because she loves the limelight like I do. Yes, I'm a star. Yes, she is the a star stars. back in Italy, aren't you? Oh, see, see, see. Yes, she is. But only because I'm very, very, very wealthy. Yeah, you're very wealthy. I know you and are. I, I know you, my friend, you don't care if I have money or not, but some people no, take no. me for granted every yes, day. I Can I have money for this? Can I have money for that? And you have to sort of think. Yes, I know. So instead of giving money, yeah. I buy them what they need. A car, yeah. Yeah. a fridge. I know, that's really, you really... You know, washing and, machine. And the things that you bought for me, I... You bought me a very, very exciting, uh, you know, little outfit for Henry and, at oh, night time. You know, that little negligee. Yes, yes, and it was, you know, had the... Bright red. Yeah, it had the special little, you know... The, the, li the little but I just wondered, why didn't, why didn't it have, um, like, you know... The crutchless. Like, yeah, why, why did it... It's for shy, it, it's for shy it, girls. Oh, it's for shy girls. It's for shy girls who don't want to take the pencil. I was going to... I actually got my sewing machine out and actually started sewing it up. It'd be very uncomfortable because yeah, you got a piece missing. Oh, see, I, thought, I wonder what was that for. But anyway, look, anyway, I just wondered, you know, those sort of things. What I'd do with her. Yes, I, I know, know, I know, because I really, they have sex in their cliches, don't they? Little sexy things. Oh, and, sexy, uh, and I really sexy. enjoyed you bringing back that, those little tongs. Yes, that's right. Little tongs. No, not very comfortable. What? I wear one of them. Is you got to have a search party to look for it. A search party, yeah, right? Yeah, because it's because of our... What, <coughs> what little tongs are we talking about? Yeah, little about? tongs, little paints. It's got a little string at the bottom. Oh, I see. In I see. the b bottom. Oh, okay, little things. I can't coming. read them. No, I, no, no. You can't? No, okay. no. Oh, you mean the thong? I yes. thought it said, oh, the thong. I said, the tongs. Like, I, I thought, well, the tongs is what I use in the kitchen. Well, uh, tongs. You no. said... Yeah, I, I know. I thought you said tongs, but tongs are things I use yes. in the kitchen. So... Thongs. Oh, the little Thongs. thing that goes up your butt. Okay. Yes. That's what well, I said. But I, yeah, and because my butt is so well, big, you can't find it. Well, I'm, well, I've been starting to wear uh, thongs actually down the beach. You know, last summer. And <laughs> I'm sure you look very beautiful. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and and I had a lot of people watching me. Did you realise that? I wonder why. Yeah, they're watching me and <laughs> looking at that, looking yeah. at my beautiful butt and like a know, big moon. Yes, it was like a. <laughs> <laughs> it was like an extra big moon, big. but anyway, that that's the thing. And I and I had a lot of people just staring, and I had no idea. And I thought, well, they must be staring at a beautiful bottom that's running along the beach. Whatever you say, darling. Yes, yeah, so that's it. Well, yes. Gigi, I know you're my friend, and you would never and say you know anything I'm gonna, against me. I'm, you know, I'm going away. I, I'm leaving. I'm going back to Italy. Yeah, I know. Thank I'll see you, you in another two months. Okay, please come back and tell me more see. about everything in Italy. Of course. Okay. Thank you. Arrivederci. Mm. Ti vediamo. Ciao. Ciao.
Hi Nikki, and Hello. it's great to meet you at last. Now Nikki's been a fan of the Delilah show for over four years. Weekly, been watching it at ten o'clock on Thursdays on Channel Forty Four and eleven on Sundays, weren't you? Yes. All that time. And what's it like to meet me? Amazing. I know. I know you say all the right words. <laughs> I mean, it is amazing for me to meet myself sometimes. You know what I mean? <laughs> yeah. um, I get very amazed when I see Delilah in the mirror, and and, and it's just one of those things that. It happens, you know. Um, it happens. It, it happens when I'm looking in the mirror. I get amazed. Um, it, it's a thing that we should all do. I think we all should look in the mirror. What do you think? And then look yeah. amazed at each other. <laughs> yes. Yeah, looking amazed at ourselves. Um, <laughs> because it's a positive, positive vibration. You know, I, I've been talking a little bit about the last few weeks about positive vibrations, and one of the things was this positive vibration looking in the mirror. And um, and the great thing about it, I wanted to talk more about you. I mean, enough about me. I do speak about myself quite a bit. I wanted to talk about you. What are you doing? Tell us. A safe course at the moment. Okay. In childcare. Childcare. Why? Why childcare? It's always been a passion of mine. Yeah. And and what little babies to? About six weeks to five years. Really? That'd be fun. You'll lots of changing nappies, huh? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, no, um, that is a good thing to get involved with because I, I love little babies and little children. It's terrific, you know, there's so much fun. I don't like them when they cry too much, <laughs> that's the only thing. Um, I can always give them back if they cry too much. But, yeah. and, and you're doing short movies as well? Yeah. And, and, uh, and you're enjoying that? Yes. Yeah, and what about, what other passion that you like singing? So you do yeah. sing? So you don't, have you been to karaoke yet? I'm not yet. Oh, okay, we need to organise it. I know some karaoke people that's going to help you out and take you along. When I, mean, I go to karaoke, I've got uh, probably about 10 songs they give me because they like my voice. But some of the people do go to the toilet when I'm actually <laughs> singing. And I think it's because they like to hear my voice in the distance. Um, and, I, and I can understand that because my voice carries so beautifully. You know what I mean? <laughs> yeah. So um, that's the great thing. But look, anyway, Nikki, thank you for coming on the show, and please come back, and we'd love yes. you to come back and, you know, do some more stuff with us, that'd be great. Okay. All right. Nikki, everybody, and, and do you prefer to be called just Nikki? Yeah. Nikki. Okay. Take care. You Well, wasn't that a wonderful show, and I just love seeing you, but please, please subscribe, and we'll see you next Thursday at 8pm. See you then! Bye!